Hi, my name is Jonathan Wilkins and I'm going to give you a quick tour of the lovely Adaran Club Renali in the Maldives. As you can see, it's a small island and it's located to the south of Mali Airport in the South Mali Atoll. It's a 45 minute speedboat ride south um, and it's about a distance of 34 kilometres. This, as I say, is the South Mali Atoll. So Adaran Club Renali um, has 96 um, standard rooms, which are all located on the island where I'm pointing the cursor now, around there. It consists of two storey blocks of four. So two bedrooms, two rooms downstairs, two rooms upstairs uh, in blocks of four, and it goes around the island. So it's got a real lovely club feel, hence the name Adaran Club Renali. Uh, some years back, this was an Italian only island, uh, but now it's a very international island um, with people from all over the world coming to this, particularly Europeans, Australians. Um, so it's a real mixture there. And like I say, it's quite a simple island, but it's got um, a lot, lot to it. So it's one of the five islands within the Aiken Spence family. So um, as I say, when you arrive into Mali Airport, you come out and all the desks are in front of you. You go to the Aiken Spence or the Adaran Inheritance Desk and they will take you to the speedboat. Now the speedboats go from right out in front of the, the airport and it's a 45 minute speedboat ride and you'll arrive here on the jetty here. So let's go to the jetty. So this is the view you get when you arrive and you'll see on the right there is our dive center. Straight ahead is reception. And where I'm pointing the cursor now is our main bar. This island has one restaurant and two bars. So it's quite simple, but it's one of my favorite islands. Down there in the distance are the water villas. Just so you know, that water villa there is now just a single story. So we've got, as I say, six, uh, 26 water villas and 96 standard rooms. So just looking to the right here, this island is great for diving because you can literally walk off the beach in and dive. So this dive center is called Dive Point. And this is the brand of dive company, which we use um, in our Adaran hotels. And it's a German operation and here you can do your paddy course. So you arrive straight down, walk down to reception. Uh, I'm now looking back at the, um, the jetty where you arrived. And I'm just gonna turn around here. I hope you don't get too seasick or from me spinning around, but sandy floor, large open reception. And that's how the reception looks. We don't hoover the, the floor in our reception, we rake it. So over here on the on the where I'm pointing is the is the the notice board with excursions and what's happening in the resort. If I turn slightly to the left, you'll see this is the main bar. So this is the reception area, and out the back here is a children's play area, and to the right here is a large sandy beach area and the dive centre. Now let's go to some of the main areas of the island. So we've done the reception. Let's go to the arrival jetty. We've just done that. Looking back. We now go to um, the accommodation. It's quite a simple island to sell because there's only two types of accommodation, standard rooms and bungalow rooms. So standard rooms, as I mentioned to you, are in blocks of four upstairs and downstairs uh, rooms. So this is the standard room. They've got AC, which is controllable yourself. It's spacious, uh, a large double bed in the room. That door we we'll go through in a minute is through to the bathroom. That door goes outside. So looking out here, you have your own patio doors. This one, of course, is downstairs. We have upstairs with balcony. So this one's literally by the, the, the water sports center. We have a mini bar on the right here. Two bottles of water are given to you daily. Uh, mini bar is not included in the all inclusive, but there are things within that. Coffees and teas uh, machine there. And so that's it. If you want an extra person in the room, you can have an extra bed. Maximum in this room type is three. Let's just go outside in the bathroom, out that door. So we're now into the bathroom, you know, fairly simple. It's got a hairdryer, all, the, all of the um, extras in there, you know, sort of toiletries, comb, razor, um, buds, um, shampoo and conditioner. Towels are changed daily. Now this category here, the stand room, has a shower only. It's quite a large shower. So there are no baths, they're only shower. So decent size. Right, let's now go down to the to the water bungalows. They're at the far end of the island. And we've got 26 of these. These are sort of dark wood style. Um, 
and outside you have your own decking area. A lot of privacy here. I, I can't go outside there on this, I don't think, so I'll go back to that. And then turning around, that's the bathroom there. Uh, Marshall stereo, mini bar, and water every day. Let's go to the bathroom. It's a bigger bathroom than the previous one I showed you. Um, so um, just turning around, it's a bit hard to turn around with this. Let's see. And of course, access straight out to the to the, the decking at the back. So you don't have to walk with wet feet through the room if you need to go to the bathroom. Um, shower there. And so that's the bathroom. And, and so now let's go to um, the main areas. So we have one restaurant on this island. And I'd say the, the array of food is quite comprehensive. So this when you arrive, you're allocated a table and a server. If you're not happy with that table, you can change it. But we found that we had a great rapport with our server um, who, you know, we got on very well with. So down here, you've got soups, spreads. And of course, this is changing daily themed as well. Hot and cold salads. And it goes all the way around past those uh, live cooking stations right around the corner here. And again, on the opposite here, you can see some live cooking stations. Then we have the desserts, that's ice creams and cakes and various things there. So this is a quite a comprehensive um, offering. And as I say, you are allocated a server on arrival. So that's the main one and only restaurant. We do have bars, um, so let's take you to the main bar. If you recall on arrival, uh, the jetty I pointed out that building, this is the main focal point of the island for entertainment. Each night we have um, someone, a band playing music, um, Here's where you're served your alcoholic beverages, served by the glass, um, whether it's beer, wine, cocktails. Um, and in between meals, which is breakfast, lunch, and dinner, we're, this area here is where you can get snacks. So there's juices, coffees, teas, cakes, uh, various different things come along. Um, we even have a shisha here. So in terms of the all-inclusive in this island, um, the Offering is breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks, and your drinks, but it's more local drinks than international branded drinks. So um, that's why it's more of a simplified all-inclusive, but they are all included. This decking area here, you'll see a heron walking about quite often. That's another island, of course, uh, in the distance there. Um, swimming around the island, we swam around it, it took us about 40 minutes, but it, you know, we didn't swim continuously, but there's, uh, I just went recently with my family and um, of the five islands within the Aitken Spence Hotels in the Maldives, my kids said this was their second favourite, just because they love the vibe about the place. So straight in front of you, there's a shop selling um, various little bits and bobs, touristy type things, sun cream, etc. Um, so that's the main bar. Now we're going to go to the far end of the island near the Water Villas. Down here is the Nika Bar. And so that's right in front of the water villas. And there are snacks served here, but we kind of play on this as a, as a, a bar area, really. So just to show you, I mentioned about the standard rooms. They're in blocks of four. Upstairs, two rooms. Downstairs, two rooms. Every room faces the sea. Um, there's quite a lot of greenery on this island and um, lots of shade. Um, in terms of beach, um, lots of little areas. I just want to revert back to the main uh, aerial shot of the island. You'll see down here, this is the main sort of beach area where it never really got crowded when, in all the times I've been there. I've been there a number of times. In the middle, here's all the staff quarters. Like I say, this is the standard rooms going down all the way around. And down here is water villas. So 26 water villas, 96 standard rooms. This is the dive center. Um, and of course, where the water is darker, that is where the it's deeper, um, but diving is quite quite good here. So if you look around, just the watercolours around, beautiful watercolours. And so, you know, it's, it's good for snorkelling here. On the subject of, um, sorry, just turn around a bit more. On the subject of uh, underwater, this is um, what you may encounter. We saw turtles, we saw an array of fish. You'll never be disappointed with snorkeling in the Maldives. Um, 
So that's the underwater. And then onto other facilities, um, we have a spa. So down towards the end where the uh, water fillers are, we have uh, a, a few spa spa rooms. This is Balinese style, uh, Balinese staff, uh, well trained. Um, probably the busiest time is probably four o'clock till seven thirty. Um, but most people going to the Maldives will experience a spa treatment at some point. So we have single rooms and we have double rooms. And that's at the, the the water villa end of the island, and then we have water sports. With this all inclusive, um, the water sport part is not included, so there are chargeables. So anything you see there, whether it's non-motorized or motorized, is is not included in the all-inclusive. But if you want to use the hobby cat, which is the uh, the boat, this um, catamaran style boat here, you need a license. There's various things there and canoes and water things. So that room I showed you earlier on was that room there. So, but it has a really nice vibe. It feels like a village. Um, we have a lot of repeaters. This is uh, the water point, point, water point spot. So, so in summary, uh, a beautiful island, it's quite small. It's, although basic in terms of outlets, one restaurant, two bars, there's enough there for everyone. Um, it's not uncommon for people to stay two weeks, but you know, most will stay seven to 10 days, um, but two weeks, three weeks is not uncommon at all. So that's the Adaran Club Renali. Um, if you're also interested in seeing um, a bit more information about this island, if you just uh, go to select-rep.com, which I'm just gonna show you now. Um, here we go. On this website, select-rep.com, I list all the hotels that are in the same group. So Aiken Spence Maldives has a number of hotels and they're all listed here. So in the South Mali at all, relevant to what we're talking about, Adaran Club Rali on my website, select rep.com, keep saying it. This is giving, gonna give you a summary of what's uh, some useful points. So there's fact sheets, what's included. It's all there number of rooms, what's included in the rooms, et cetera, et cetera. And then we have, um, very importantly, actually the resort map. This is useful for explaining to customers or potential customers where rooms are located and, and where the shops are and the water sports are. I mentioned the spa is down there. So this is quite useful. So um, that's the map. And then we go to what's included the all-inclusive, client videos, um, down here, just some bullet points about the island. But all of these images I'm showing you here are displayed within the drop box provided. So that's the main restaurant, that's the standard rooms, blah, 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 blah. So they all are located in here in the image download. Of course, the all-inclusive part is the question you're gonna get asked about probably the most, what's included with the all-inclusive. So breakfast, lunch, dinner is this time. In addition, there are snacks served in the cocktail bar between these times. So, uh, and what type of drinks are served? Like I said, they're all served by the glass. So thank you very much for your time. Adaran Club Renali, four star, located in South Mali Atoll. Um, definite value for money. <laughs>